first thing, siphon diesel into the Humvee. And siphon water. Or not. Cancel that. Um. Alright, where the hell my 2x4s go? <laughs> hey, 2x4s, what did I do with you? Ah, oh, they're in the other pile. <laughs> Activate Frazier there. Drop. Uh, two two by fours. Yeah, let's drop all four just in case. Have zombies coming through the water, hopping up on the bridge. That's a bunch of nonsense. <laughs> Try again. Alright, fill the Humvee, please. Do it again. Do it again. Oops. Alright. That's really all the water? Uh, why is it not counting that water? That's not good. That's what I was hoping it was doing. And we lost the light, or the fire. Not surprising since it started to rain. <laughs> Down to 21 liters, and we've got 15 in there. I don't have the kitchen unit yet, so I can't just cook it like an or boil it like I usually do. Um, I think it would be good enough for what we got, though. Okay, whoops. Can I park this thing with no diesel blocking the entire <laughs> bridge? Hopefully I've got a way around it. That would have been kind of silly. Let's... Oh, that's right. I also don't have a way of drinking out of the tank. Eh, it's fine. I can get around it. <laughs> Do there. Come on, hit points! Give me that last bar. It's been more than a week. <laughs> it didn't even budge again! Ugh. Alright, I do have room to get around that thing, so... Um, let's make one last check with the solar vehicle. I think I got everything I care about. Not going to put an electric motor in, but let's take one with us just in case. No, actually, this is a standard electric motor. I don't want that anyway. 
I want the large one or the enhanced one. So, vehicle's not quite complete, and I forgot that I'm going to be replacing that <laughs> with a kitchen unit eventually, um, and or I'll be re redesigning something, but uh, I will need to switch these things over to free that up once I find it. Other than that, I think we're ready to go. So we've got 23 liters of diesel, which is not a lot, but that should be enough for me to find some more. Um, Huge, huge upgrade in vehicle and in capabilities. Let's take a look at our gear. I need to repair my flame resistant suit and my quiver. Uh, tools here. Get sewing kits. And we damaged it. <laughs> damaged it again. Alright, got that thing reinforced. Next, the quiver. Uh, I'm not going to worry about reinforcing that. Oops. Pretty sure I won't be able to do that. Eh, I could if I kept trying. Takes Kevlar plates and such. Sure, give it a try. Uh, use the rag. Yay! How about the suit? And of course, the suit we fail. Fail twice. That's the most important parts. I'll wait on the rest. All right. <laughs> Little afternoon. Dang it, I ate the wrong thing again. <laughs> Just like dried beans. Yeah, yeah. I need some good old other other white meat. Alright. I'm still I think the last thing I need now, I need the kitchen unit. I need the gun for the vehicle. Check my notes here. Got that one done. So I still need the one more optic so I can get the telescope built and kitchen unit and then the machine gun and we'll be sitting pretty. Alright, so at this point, do we just go across the bridge and keep driving? Or do we back up? I don't really see a reason to back up. I think we should just get moving across the bridge. Yeah, we haven't seen an NPC in forever. Oh, man. <laughs> yep, it's my traditional Vormobile. Good old Humvee. Love the Humvees. Just the right size to get me the stuff that I need or want. And, uh... Small enough to still be maneuverable. Oh yeah, and diesel is going to be a pretty critical thing too. Let's get moving. See if we can get around this thing here without breaking anything. 
All right, now it feels like a warm live stream as we tool around in our Humvee. All right, pretty close to having my normal, fairly optimal setup. Hey there, Beehive. Oh, Beehive with an Apis. That's what I needed. I actually need to go get that stereo system so I can... Oh, look at that! Shipwreck! Should we go check it to see if they uh, give any of the damn... Row. <laughs> All right. Grocery store, an ambulance, standard zombies. Um, can't. I won't be able to see what's in the cargo carriers for the ambulance. So let's pull off to the side. And hop out. Let's kill some zombies. It's been too long. Alright, let's go with... What's our rifle skill at? We're at still at 2. I haven't been using the crossbow enough early to get that skill up. Uh, let's stick with the axe. Hey! Stop banging on my vehicle! No grabbing. Punk? He hit me in the eyes again. And it doesn't really say. Left arm. <laughs> There's an eye poke again. Damn bastards. care about any of that. Don't care about that. Alright, let's go check out the ambulance. Ah, oh, it's empty? It's empty! <laughs> Alright, oh well. Uh, big old residential area. Don't care about any of that. Not going to be content until I get about 40 more liters of diesel. Right now we're still... Oh, there we go! That's what I need right exactly there. <laughs> Another Humvee might have diesel, but more importantly a tank! Oh, a self-propelled howitzer, but I think that will have the gun I need. Uh, the M2 Browning. Yep, that's the one I want. So that'll give me the uh, semi-auto fire that I need so I can easily take out shocker brutes and things like that. So, a whole bunch of fat zombies coming, or bloated zombies. So far, I don't see anything I'm worried about. Let's just do the same thing, I guess. Alright, forgot the mask with me. Yes, it's not active yet. I've got carry capacity. We're good to go. Maybe I should hit those guys with the crossbow. That's <laughs> nah, not really going to matter. Alright, come get me. Alright, let's get this thing on before... Activate! Damn it! More hit point, hit point damage. Don't want head damage. Alright, a whole herd of dogs coming down at me. What else? Nothing I'm worried about yet. Ugh. 
Really? Is it the dogs that are grabbing me? Because <laughs> that seems a little odd. That was a few coochies. Not much diesel there. Hopefully the howitzer's got a ton though. If I can get diesel and the uh, machine gun off that howitzer, things will be good. Actually, I forgot to look what what gun do you have? Uh, it's got the grenade launcher. Eh, might be interested in the grenade launcher. No ammo for it though. Come on, get over here. Soldier. Alright, still still nothing I'm worried about. Would like to avoid getting totally surrounded again though. <laughs> Is it gonna stop? They're just gonna keep pouring at me. Yeah, more shotgun ammo. Lots of backpacks, golf shoes. Pants and dead zombies. Okay. Let's check this thing out. There's some diesel. Now I'm happy. Uh, I don't need the storage batteries. Oh, no ammo for the browning. So it's got the gun, but no ammo for it. All right. I'm not sure. I don't think I picked up any 50 caliber ball ammo yet either. Um, what is that? 70? That's like 80 liters of diesel, though. That's more than I can carry currently. Hmm. Might have to rip out a 60 liter tank. Come here, you guys. Get over here. I'm going to spend that much time in the area. I'm going to have to pulp all this crap, though. Get over here, stupid shady dummy. Yeah, I'll get inside the vehicle and check the uh, stuff here in a second. There might be dairy cans plus ammo laying on the ground that hasn't been loaded yet. Just making sure the area is clear before I get into this thing, otherwise I'm going to have to listen to stuff banging on the uh, armor. Alright, I do see a basement in the house just north of me. And looks like we got all the local stuff. What you got for me? Don't care about the frag. There's the jerry can of some diesel. And ammo, ammo. There we go. 100 rounds of 50 caliber. That's what I needed. Uh. So there was 175 rounds. Interesting. Alright, I'm not going to reload the Browning because I'm going to dismount it, take it with me, and I'm going to pull the vehicle up and siphon into my vehicle, but I need another 60 liter tank. And I need to make sure I get all this done before this stuff all stands back up again. <laughs> so, let's... Both tanks are yellow. Good enough for me. 
Ah. Where were you a while ago there, guy? I was trying to clear the area. What's going on? <laughs> Solar cell. That's funny. Alright, let's try again. Alright, we got the tank. Grab that. I still gotta go back and get the machine gun. We'll do that when I park next to this thing. Alright, whoops. Let's throw the extra tank back here. Nope, don't want the 10 liter tank. I have to siphon this thing before I do anything. Whoops. Unload. Tank of diesel into the vehicle. Now install back here. Alright, now we've got an extra tank, so I can have two tanks of diesel and one of clean water. Now we need to park next to that thing, siphon, and grab the machine gun. Whoops. Hey there, zombies. Whoops, not using my weapon. Uh, where'd my fire axe go? Oh, I damaged my fire axe again. Now an acid zombie shows up, or a spitter zombie. Um, all right, come get some spitter. Good job. Come on, leave me alone for just a little bit longer, zombies. Just give me a little bit of time, and I'll be all set and happy. Uh, yeah, let's dump the ammo. Stop it. <laughs> the crawling zombies are closing in on me. Siphon. Got it all. Look at that. Almost two completely full tanks of diesel. This is quite the good luck. Now let's grab the M2 Browning that's pretty messed up. Uh, is there another one? That's the main turret there. Yeah, that's the only one. Give me that Browning. God, I hope I have the rifle skill to install it. Alright, so we got the Browning. I don't care about the batteries. I don't want the howitzer. Uh, I'll take the harness though. Fine. Kill the stupid fat zombie. No, that's not my tank. That's a self-propelled howitzer. 
So, self-propelled howitzer. Most of the large military vehicles have a whole crap load of tanks. So, there's only 60 liters is as big as the tanks get, so they tend to have a, just a bunch of them. Main battle tanks have even more than that one does. That list actually scrolls with... Yeah, that list. Alright, it's got everything I need. Um, I just need to... Drop the raw materials. Drop the food. And... Remove... Hopefully. Unload. Now we're gonna remove... And install... Oh, thank God! Rifles 2. So the crossbow has been doing good just because it's going to allow me to install my mounted M2 Browning. Needed rifles 2 for it. There we go. And now we will reload the Browning. Need a compatible magazine? Um... I do? <laughs> um... Alright, I thought I brought what I needed. Yeah, the turret's completely gone. That's right. That ammo was sitting on the ground, so it's not in linkages. So that's the problem. Yeah, I need an ammo belt. The ammo is laying on the ground, not loaded into belts, so... I unfortunately won't be able to fire it quite yet. We got some spare ammo, but unless I can put it into linkages or into belts, that's not going to help me any. Um, so... I think we're ready to get moving as soon as I dump this jerry can. Well, we almost got everything I wanted. Tank didn't have ammo in belts. So, it's close. Not quite. Hey, there are turrets. We'll avoid the turrets. Um, I'm not going to bother following that road. It's, normally I would go see what those endpoints are, but almost no facility that I would care. Oh, there we go. Is that a wreck, or is that ready to go, and can I pull the kitchen unit? All right, first off, straighten this thing out. <laughs> Uh, it doesn't really matter, because there's a working kitchen unit right there, whether this one is working or not. It's a good luxury RV, with five more liters of diesel. And a full storage battery. Ooh. That might be worth grabbing. And all the goodies. And this is going to be a, diesel, a jerry can of gas as well, probably. No, nope, bottle jacket. It's a bottle jacket and a spare wheel. Alright. Funnily enough, this thing actually drives. <laughs> Just gotta get past the security system. And the engine's pretty faulty. Not too bad, though. Nah, these are standard solar panels, aren't they? Yeah, these are standard. These aren't the upgraded. I don't want them. These are poor boy solar panels. I'm interested in diesel and in the storage battery, and that's about it. So let's grab that jerry can. Finish filling it up. Alright, and I also need the pallet lifter and the frame. This part kind of sucks, but for now, that's how I'm going to do it.
Alright, so where is that power stored? Ooh. Red storage battery. Take it anyway. Uh, anything else I care about here? No. batteries. Where are my... I was pretty sure I had them right here. Why are they not showing? Oh, I got them up there. Ouch! That's not where I wanted them. Yeah, that wasn't good. Um... Oh well. <laughs> I need the lifting tool to install it as well? That doesn't make any sense. God dang it. <laughs> Don't make me put this thing back together. Uh, about to get dark too, so we're going to end up sleeping right here. Well, that's... that's stupid. <laughs> Ugh. Damn zombies! Ooh, I don't have a wood saw. <laughs> okay, what are you guys following to find me now? Is this just a random wandering horde deciding to come over to me? Looks like it. One, two, three, four, five. Am I next to a prison? I'm next to a prison. Alright. This is not ideal. Well, hey, there's my iBot. Oh boy. That's right, I'm next to a prison. Lots of iBots. This is going to get a little icky. I'm tired. It's dark. It's going to get real dark here in a second. If it, actually, it might be a full moon. Um, most of the guys to the south are playing with the iBot so far. Alright, let's just start wailing away with a fire axe. Um, I need to get the crossbow out to handle the iBot and then kill the zombies. Wield, crossbow, repair, or reload. Fire, precise, reload. Uh, did it die? Where the hell did it go? There better be an iBot on the ground. Where the hell? Okay, now I'm, now I'm irritated. <laughs> now I are irritated. Alright. Whatever, game. Alright, now I are irritated even more. There's one of them over banging on the side of my vehicle. Get out of my car! <laughs> Punk. Yeah. 
Yeah, I are irritated. No, it can't change Z levels. Sometimes I've seen them just disappear like that. It's just really annoying. I'm gonna need to actually pulp all this crap. <laughs> Storm, don't care about the cash cards. I do care about the Kevlar vest. Very hungry, very thirsty. Should be more iBots around the front of the, uh, the building, so I should still get my, my item. I'm just kind of annoyed that I hit that one and then it decided to disappear on me. Riot helmet, chest rig. Try again. 42 minutes. No wonder I'm running into zombies constantly. Alright, now we've got more than enough power than we'll ever use. Um, should be able to take this down now. Alright, I'm going to keep the Kevlar vest so I remember to clean it up and wear it. I need that one piece of vector protection, although that is going to jack up my encumbrance. I might have to stop using the large quiver, or at least stop having it strapped on to me. Alright, we'll see. Let's take care of food first. Alright, this will be fun, sleeping right next to the prison. First, let's make sure I pulped everything. Nope, I did not. <laughs> uh, that's because I didn't kill those. That guy I did. Well, this will be a little interesting. We'll see if we actually manage to sleep. It's already 1.30 in the morning. We'll let the dawn wake us up if it goes that long without a zombie showing up. I need to look at... Damn it! Six in the morning. Eh, we got a decent amount of sleep. Who came to visit? Just a standard old zombie. Okay. Um, go find an iBot. Let's wield our crossbow. I don't want to play with you, zombie. I want an iBot. Alright, there's one in sight. Two of them. Uh... Hmm, what kind of best we got out there? MBR vest with steel plating. We'll take that. I can swap it out for Kevlar. Ooh, super heavy. Ah, oh, bio operator. Oh, helicopter crash site. Just north. Um, yeah, I, I just want the iBot. But I don't want to go towards the bio operator. That one's moderately injured. Um, let's try to stay near the. Oh, look at that, another Humvee over there. Got the M60. Alright, I need to back off. I need to dump this items off before I try anything. Can't have zero weight. 
Zombies are making my life difficult. Ah, they're coming south. Come on, iBots, where'd y'all go? Are there any dead ones nearby? Doesn't look like it. Five operators going after the iBot. That's kind of irritating. <laughs> uh, God dang it. <laughs> uh, quest for an iBot. Can't believe this. No one went north. Now, there he is. There is a dead one up here. Alright, broken eye bot. That's all I want. Give me that. I'm out of here. Ah, that was not good. Now I got multiple bioperators on me and I'm out of stamina. Eh, this is going to be yucky. Drop. Oh, not the crossbow. Drop the stupid eye bot. I just got knocked down by the bio-operator. Yeah, this is bad. This is very bad. This could kill me right here. Yeah, I think I'm gonna die right here. Three bio- or two bio-operators and a soldier. And me with no stamina. I, I underestimated how much stamina I would lose trying to carry that iBot out. My only chance is just to take the hits while I try to get my stamina back. Ugh. I'm gonna die right here. Alright, right when I got all my stuff fixed up. <laughs> um. Yep, definitely gonna die. I think this thing's a single shot only. Yep, semi-auto only. God, this sucks. <laughs> oh well, I get my car fixed up and first thing I do is wander into multiple bio-operators and zero up my stamina. That was a really bad move on my part. This will go down as a Vorm was dumb death. Uh, I can't think of any way to get out of this. These guys are all super fast compared to me. They're just going to keep hammering me into the dirt. Pain is going to keep skyrocketing. Stats are going to keep dropping. I'm never going to recover my stamina. It's going to take multiple shots from the gun, even if I was able to land a shot, which I'm almost guaranteed not to. I got nothing I can get to to try to hide. Caffeine pill's not going to help. Not nearly enough. And it's going to take several turns of uh, actions in order to use it. Problem is just a matter of scale. Nothing's going to help me enough to get me away from these things. If I had an adrenaline pump, that might be enough to get me away from them for a short amount of time. So I could get into a vehicle and get my stamina back. But 
none of the stuff I've got with me is going to come anywhere remotely close enough. And I'm just going to get hit seven or eight times by the time I just even take a pill. <laughs> oh, man, this sucks. Spent all that time getting the vehicle fixed up, and then I get killed by bio-operators. None of these are going to help. Yeah, there's just nothing that's really going to do it. I could take a hit of oxygen, but again, it's just not going to be enough, and I'm going to get hit half a dozen times just taking the hit. We'll try it. Yeah. Like I said, it's not going to happen. We're going to die right here. There's just absolutely no way I can get away from these guys. Uh, That one's heavily injured. I guess we'll try to hit him, but I'm going to lose my arms here. There's no way I can afford to even aim. So it's going to be a snapshot and hope that I hit with a 45% chance. Nope. Nope. Eh, there goes one arm. Of course, that was about gone. Killed one of them. Run mode. I got a tiny bit of stamina. No way. We're just, we're just not. We don't have enough room to get away from it. Yeah, it's the oxygen hit that's getting me some stamina back. But as soon as I start running, plus with all the pain I'm in, yeah, <laughs> my speed is negative seventy-seven percent. My speed is twenty-five. What that means is, I'm gonna try to move a space. They're gonna hit me about a dozen times each. <laughs> oh man. No, this one I'm absolutely sure I'm dead. <laughs> the school, there was a chance. This one's there's no chance. Ugh. What could I possibly do? Uh, I can't believe this. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Too far from those vehicles. I'm going to try to run to that car, try to get the car between me and that bio-operator, but I don't think it's going to happen. Watch what happens. I'm in run mode, but I have a speed of 25. It's going to take me four, four of their turns to move a single space. It's not going to matter. There's no way I can get out of this. Too much pain, too much uh, stat loss. I can't even move a space. If I try to move a space, I'm going to die. So, I'm just take a shot. <laughs> He's getting like four swings to my one. Watch what happens. I'll try to move a space. Here's what happens. Eh, we didn't take as much as I thought, but we instantly zeroed out my stamina. <laughs> the soldier keeps getting in the bio-operator's way. That's kind of funny. Hey, here comes another soldier. All right, soldiers are in the way. Oh, now he's going to come around. Hmm. Is he going to come around, or is he going to try to beat his way through? Oh, man. We might have a chance now. Come on, I need a nice strong hit on this guy. I gotta kill these two and... Alright, first thing I need to do is close that door. Then I need to shoot these two. Get my stamina back. Oh, man. No, we got a chance right now. If I can keep these soldiers from hitting my torso, kill the two soldiers before this guy rips through the vehicle, I'll be able to move up, put the engine block between me and him. That'll give me enough time to get my stamina back and to lower some of the pain, take a medicine, things like that. So it's all going to come down to, can I kill these two soldiers with my gun before they hit me for that last two hit points of torso damage. <laughs> so I'm trying to aim a few times, but they're hitting me each time I try to aim. Oh no, now they're tag teaming me. Severely injured. It's just not doing enough damage. Now i got both of them going to be hitting me. Alright, another one down. 
Oh boy. This one's severely injured. Oh man. Both arms broken. <laughs> it's so bad. If I survive this, you saw how long it took me to heal from two bars of head health to not even full. It took like a week <laughs> just to heal that. Now add in two broken arms. Oh my god. Uh, still more stuff in the area too. Oh no, two more coming down. Oh, uh, this is not good. <laughs> not for long. He's going to come through the side of that vehicle any minute. I don't think this uh, quarter panel is going to take much more damage and then he'll be able to step right through it and hit me. So we're nowhere near there yet. And my, my speed is still pretty much null. We gotta take an oxy. They're chasing a dog, thank god. I need them to chase the dog while I maneuver to the front of the vehicle. So he starts coming through a different part of the vehicle. Please keep chasing the doggy. Let me get this guy trying to come through the uh Ah oh, another one's coming from the north! And he already came through the windshield. Yep, still gonna die. Son of a bitch. <laughs> uh, so many bio-operators! Ah, there's no way I'm going to be able to manage this one. Fire! He better be wounded. Nope, it's only lightly wounded. He's going to probably make it all the way to me before I get a couple of shots off. Oh, yeah, he's going to get all the way to me. This thing was full auto? Maybe. I need like two headshots, but I don't think I'm going to get them. Yeah, there we go. Instantly dead. <laughs> oh my god, that was what? Five bio-operators? Something like that? Because there was one that chased down the far side. Two, three, at least four bio-operators. However many soldiers. Oh, I don't believe it. All I wanted was an iBot. <laughs> I'm dead because I tried to carry an iBot back. And it zeroed out my stamina. Ugh. That was a rough one because that was pretty much totally my fault. I just... I thought they were too far away and that they had wandered off. That's all it takes. Alright. Well... Officially I was trying to uh, get to that refugee center. <laughs> Uh, I forgot to look at how many uh, NPCs we killed. I think we were at nine on my kill list, plus I had run over two or three. So we got up to about 12 for the kills. Oh, man, I'm just bummed out that I spent, what, a couple hours <laughs> sitting there getting the vehicle put together, and then I got to drive it all of about five miles and then got killed. That's what happens, though, especially when you've got the uh, spawn rate cranked up. You get that kind of situation, but if it hadn't been for the multiple bio-operators on me at once, I would have been okay, but those guys are too nasty for that kind of situation with me zeroing out my strength and my speed so much. Alright, well that's, uh, I don't know if I consider that one a victory or a loss. Originally it was just kill a bunch of NPCs. I got 12, which is, I guess, a pretty decent number. They stopped showing up, though, so i um, not sure if I'm going to continue doing another one of this one. Um, I'll probably pick some other challenge. So Friday I'll be back for more of Cataclysm, and uh, tune in then, 4 o'clock Central, Central Time U.S. I'll fire it up, and uh, I'll think about it. I might try this one again with a variation a bit, or uh, we'll figure out a new one to try.